I came here for revenge. And one day, I will have it. Wait, revenge who? Revenge on where? Hey, Dimitri, get the fuck back here. We're up to the village. The village of, uh, Vermeer. The flame in the darkness through Vermeer Calamity. We've got to go. Now. Dad. Dad, are you okay? Uh, uh, okay. The situation in Vermeer Village has changed drastically. I assume we don't know much more anyway. than that. We're hearing reports that the villagers are killing each other. Some say houses are burning. Wait, what? Regardless, we need to move. Killing each other. Sorry, I had to make sure my OBS is recording. Ew, what the fuck? Oh god. Ew. Somebody please help! Oh the child! I must save the child. What's going on here? Got no time, we gotta save the child. Are you okay, Dimitri? Dimitri? Do you need to sit out on this one? Are you okay? I wanna say what's wrong with you, what the fuck? Don't worry about me. I'm fine. Are you sure? Don't waste your time on me. What? Saving the villagers is far more important. We haven't a moment to lose. You What can we do amid back. such confusion? We'll have to take up arms against the villagers who are rampaging. If we strike carefully, it should be possible to spare their lives. Oh dear. Isn't there a more peaceful way to deal with this? Some crazy band back. No matter how long it takes, we'll need to check and rescue them all, one at a time. Those who have gone mad may be victims themselves. Is it possible to save them? Uh, well, saving the poor people who aren't crazy is definitely our Yeah, top let's priority. save those people. First. Let's get on with it. Slow down in it. It won't do anyone any good if we panic and get injured ourselves. Fuck. Isn't that... What? Who? What? Your Highness, suspicious figures spotted in the village. They seem to be... watching the chaos. What? Are they the ones responsible for this madness? If so... it's clear what must be done. We gotta defeat them? And Kill save them people? All. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't let a single one of them escape! Sever their limbs and crush their wicked Dimitri? skulls! Dimitri! What has gone into you? You just went a whole 180. There are some suspicious looking ruffians out there. But our top priority is to rescue the villagers. Got it? Okay. I'll rein in the villagers who've turned violent. You focus on rescuing the others. Dad, you better not fucking die here. Because it would be kind of like cheesy story time. Where my dad dies, where like we were last together as mercenaries. giving orders to the others. Isn't that Tomas the librarian? What? Tomas, what are you doing here? I'm not Tomas. My name is Solon, the savior of all. What? What's the matter? Ew! So shocked you can't even speak. Ew! <laughs> you were so easily fooled by my disguise. I should have got thought it was weird. I was hiding didn't know away was in Garrick Mock to get the blood of that little girl oh, called what? Flame. 
With her blood, we'll be one step closer to realizing our goal. What the actual fuck? Defeat the enemy commander? Oh, no, Dead Knight. I'll have a bit of fun here, too. Oh, no, fuck you, dude. That's the Death Knight. He must be an ally of Tomas, or Solon, or whoever he is. Well, last time I didn't have to fight the Death Knight. I just had to go straight through nice try. and get bitch. Solon, here we go. Fight Why have you gone after this village? What are you planning? Huh. I could have conducted this experiment on any test subjects. Now that I have what I came for, I must bid you farewell. So you're not dead. You're not dead. I must go. Fuck you, Dark Knight. Death Knight. Wait! Well, I think it, if you gone. defeat the Death Knight, you get prize ops. <laughs> I will survey the village. There may still be some survivors. You saved at least half of the villagers. It's something, okay. Oh, Sylvain! <laughs> Surprising. Well, that was a total plot twist. He's not Tomas, he's Solon. What the fuck? Looks like we somehow managed to sort things out, and casualties were kept to a minimum. They said they weren't picky about who they used as their test subjects. Because of them, the people of Ramire Village. <sighs> there you are. What? The fuck? Who? What do you want? That armor. So, you're the Flame Emperor. What the hell are you doing here? Yes. I believe you have met my subordinate, the Death Knight. What about him? Oh, we've met all right. But back to you. You're the one responsible for the destruction of this village. Why? Do not get the wrong idea. What? How, what how, blazes how are we not? does that mean? It is true that I am working with Solon, but that does not mean our objectives are the same. What's your objective? Had I known they planned to do this, I would have stopped it. You have my word. Who are you? Your words are meaningless. Now, I'll have to insist that you accompany us back to the monastery. I cannot abide that. However, if you wish to join forces, I will hear your plea. Join our voice. We're not joining what? yours. The fuck? If left to their own devices, they will commit countless more violent acts like this one. Do you not wish to prevent that? Wait, you're trying to tell me you're going to take my dad away? With the sword of the creator on our side, Solon would not be a threat. Oh, you want me on your side? Uh... I, I don't know who you are! Hey, though not unexpected. I don't know who you are. I that you do not live to regret your choice. Uh-oh. Is that a big choice? That was a big choice. Gerald, Professor. Have you seen his highness? Oh. What's wrong, kid? Huh? Oh, damn it! <laughs> He's gone. How can I join their side? I don't know what their cause is. You can't just tell me that I'm gonna be like, yeah, let's go. What? Hey, I 
I've been meaning to talk to you. Since coming to the monastery, you've changed. How so? You've been angry since we first arrived in Ramayar. Oh, I have? And you look so happy when you're instructing the brats. Before the monastery, I'd never seen you bear your emotions like that. Not once. Is thanks to the students? I'm all then about the students. Perhaps it's a good thing we came to the monastery. If only so I could see your face lit up like that. Aww. Or maybe there was never any reason for us to leave the monastery in the first place. Why did we leave? Was I born after you left the monastery? Uh, I've put my foot in my mouth, huh? haven't I? We dead. Oh, I suppose it may be nearly Yes, tell me time. how it was bored, please. Come to my office when you next have a moment to spare. Okay. There's something I need to tell you. My childbirth story? I would love to learn. Just what was that about? I can't recall a time of old when you were at the monastery. I wonder what is hiding in the mist that is your past. Because my mom's buried in the monastery. And she died after giving birth to me, so it would only make sense I was in the monastery still. Professor, Are I... Are you okay? I'm sorry you saw that side of me in the village. Yeah. It must have been quite a shock to you and the others. Uh, yeah. I'm mortified by my behavior. Yeah, what happened? When I saw the chaos and violence there, my mind just went completely dark. Why? I didn't feel the same. You weren't yourself. I see why you would say that. I always strive to keep my emotions at bay, but sometimes the darkness takes hold. And Is this what Felix was talking about? It's impossible to suppress. It just shows you how lacking I am. I have much to learn. But I feel like they have these dark thoughts because they're thrown before, in so young. That someday we may find ourselves facing something we simply cannot accept. That's what the chaos in Ramayar village was to me. Solon and the Flame Emperor are both beasts who must be eliminated. Demons who kill the innocent. They aren't even human at this point. Hold on, Dimitri. Can you just imagine what if I said yes to the, the Flame Emperor of all? Yeah, let's go. Can you imagine what the fuck is going to happen to Dimitri if he finds out? He would lose it. Um, where is this anger coming from? The Flame Emperor said he was involved. I hope you guys don't hear the helicopter. I'm not going to mention what the Flame Emperor said because we don't know anything. So where is this anger coming from? It must be hard to fathom. It's true that I don't have any strong connection to those villagers. And yet... You see, Professor. I saw the same flames of torment just four years ago. In Dusker. Mercy. Is that Dimitri? The pain! Make the burning stop! Help me! Yeah, he was so young. Did we throw into this? Avenge us! Those who killed us! Tear them apart! Is that her dad? Destroy them all! Can I give him a hug? My father. My stepmother. Four years ago, they lost their lives to those flames. I'll never forget. I still remember their faces. That was his dad, I'm assuming. Their screams. The tortured last moments of every person who died that day. But right now, all that matters is that we do whatever we can to help the surviving villagers get back to their normal lives. Oh my god. Thank you. For everything. Can we give him a hug? There's a reason that I came to the Officer's Academy. Just one reason. Hmm. I came here for revenge. And one day, I will have it. Wait, revenge who? Revenge on where? Hey, Dimitri, get the fuck back here. Fighting for revenge is bad. That's never the answer. You did well handling that awful business in Ramayar village. Oh, I am you. certain the goddess shares in our grief at the senselessness of that calamity. More importantly, I was shocked to hear that our own Tomas was actually a dark mage. Yeah. I must reflect Fuck on that our guy. blindness. He was creepy anyway. You surely must. 
You failed to notice that a rat was hiding in your home. What if she's not? What if she's just pretending? I swear, I feel like she's a bad person. Who are these wicked foes? How did Tomas escape your gaze? And Yurta and everybody. Who are these villains? Why did Tomas come to the monastery? I feel like he, cut, he, he already said for Flame. And, you know, probably to read up on the books, because, you know, books. Tomas came to the monastery 40 years ago, by recommendation of House Ordelia of the Alliance. Who? Around eight years ago, he went back to House Ordelia, before returning to the monastery once again, just last year. After having worked at Garrig Mach for decades, why would he betray us now? Just what did he hope to accomplish? To get Fling's blood. Yuritsa became a professor at the Officer's Academy because of a recommendation from the Imperial Nobility. Supposing that he is the Death Knight, that means that our enemy is an organization that has taken root in at least two territories. In the long history of the Church of Seros, no, long before even that, there have been an endless number of threats to the peace of Fogun. Bro, you guys have a lot of enemies. Yet those who oppose us still operate in the shadows. Their identity is a mystery. You're one. I believe that Solon and the Death Knight are merely one part of a much larger whole. A threat to Fodlin's peace? That means we have no choice. We have to stop them all. I can't stop everyone. What do you think I am, a superhero? I mean, a main character, but they must be stopped. I have truly come to rely on you. I believe that the monastery will remain safe so long as we have you. We do not yet know the enemy's objective or whereabouts. For now, please devote yourself to preparing for whatever comes next. I got a plan. I got a plan, Lady Area. I'm gonna pretend to join their side, and then I'll pick them off one by one. <laughs> that is all for today. All right. Well, see you later then, Professor. Please wait. Oh yes. I know there is much that you still do not understand. However, I do not understand my armor one boobs. One thing is clear. You possess great power. I believe that you are destined to be a source of great hope for all. In any case, I expect great things from you. Walk this world proudly, dear professor. I will. May the goddess Sothis protect you. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. The goddess wait. Sothis? Is that what she just said? Bitch, I got a goddess in me. Is something the matter? I had never heard the name of the goddess. Ugh. I see. Oh shit. So this is the goddess's true name. <laughs> she did not like that. Please do not use it carelessly. Farewell. Hey, don't blame me, okay? Do not say something that we may regret. She... I... What exactly am I? You're a goddess, duh. For now, let's leave this place. Please, go. I didn't mean to... I mean, I already dissed the goddess, first of all. With Gerald. Now I just the, the goddess again. Well, Lady Rhea. <laughs> okay. Part one. White cloud. Okay, Dad. Dad, we're gonna wait right here. I gotta use the bathroom again. So this is where we're gonna use uh use. We're gonna end today's episode off. And then I think I have enough time for one more before Tyler comes home at 7. So, thank you guys for watching today's episode. Stay beautiful, and I'll see you guys in the next one.